If you're using Google Finance application from time to time within your Google Apps here, I'm going to show you how to easily install this on your Windows 11 PC so that you don't have to open up your browser and go to Google and go to Apps just to use the application. So how do you do that? First thing you need to do is go to Google and click on the Google Apps. Scroll down to where you find the finance. Click on that. Now from here, all you need to do to install the application is click the tree that's on the uppermost right hand side of Chrome and simply go to save and share and click create a shortcut. Now, you're not going to just create a shortcut with this. I'm going to show you with one click of a button, a simple trick so that you can easily install this as an application. All you need to do is click and open as a window and then click on create. And voila, look on my lower right hand side. Google Finance is installed as an application. And to prove this to you that it's an application, click the tree that's within the app here. And as you can see, here, it says uninstall finance. You can only uninstall an application if it's an application, right? And here as well, you can see it says app info. The next proof I want to show to you is simply go ahead and close out of this app here. Click the Windows key on your keyboard and simply type in finance, right? And here you can see Google Finance as an application. You can easily open that. And once the application is open, you can do quite a lot with it. You can right click on it and you can pin it to your taskbar, or you can simply go ahead and find the Google Finance application here, and you can pin it to your start bar just like this. So I'm gonna simply pin it to start. So whenever I click on my taskbar here and scroll down, I have the Google Finance here, and I can always move it all the way to the top if I so desire and put it wherever I want the application to be. Now guys, I really hope that you found this tutorial very helpful. And if you do, go ahead and give this video a like and share your comments below. I'd really appreciate that. And if you've seen the channel for the first time, welcome to Drew Tutorial. I'm Anjo, and I really appreciate if you hit the subscribe button below to help grow this community. And also, so that you'll never miss out when I release another helpful tutorial just like this one. Thank you very much and see you next time.